Welcome to another Polkadot tutorial. In today's video, I'm going to talk about batch calls and specifically about batch transfers. Batch transfers are transfers that can be made from one account to multiple accounts at the same time. Before diving into today's tutorial, if you find these videos helpful, please hit the like and subscribe buttons below as this will help other people to find our content. And if there is something that we didn't cover yet and you're interested in, drop us a message. Here we are on the Polkadot.js user interface. We are currently connected to an RPC node on the Western network. Western is a testnet and we are dealing with tokens, Western tokens that do not carry any economic value. In this case, we have three accounts and we will try to send five Western tokens to Dan and Frank from Carl. So Dan and Frank will receive each five Western tokens at the same time. Batch transfers cannot be made from uh, the send button here. We need to go in the developer tab under extrinsics. Then we have to select Carl. The palette is the utility palette. Then we select batch calls. And here we can uh, select the type of palette again. So the palette is balances. And then the function is transfer keep alive. So from Carl, we are doing this utility batch call where we are now listing multiple balances transfer keep alive to the two accounts. The first is Dan and the value is uh, five Western tokens in Planck units. Then we go and click add item. We can select again the balances palette. The function is the same transfer keep alive. The account is Frank and uh, the balance is uh, the same, five Western tokens in Planck units. It's very simple to understand the utility palette works on uh, top basically of uh, the two balances palettes because uh, we are doing these uh, batch calls. So we are selecting first on the top level the batch call uh, from the utility palette and then within this um, batch call, we are doing these multiple selections of uh, multiple balances uh, transfer keep alive to different accounts. In this case, we have Dan and Frank. When we are happy with this, we can uh, submit the transaction. We are signing with Carl. The Polkadot browser extension will display some information about the extrinsic that we are signing. We can see here the method is a utility dot batch and this is the palette and this is uh, the function that we are using. We can expand this and we can see that we are sending five Western tokens to uh, this account and uh, this account here. So we have multiple balances uh, transfer keep alive calls inside uh, this um, batch call. If everything looks fine, we can sign with the Carl account and that's it. Everything went well. We can go back to accounts. And now the two accounts here have uh, 10 Western tokens. All right, I hope you learned something today about uh, batch calls and how you can send um, funds to different accounts all at the same time. And uh, thank you for watching and I see you in another video.